when you see people watering their garden, usually they've got a, a sprinkler on the end of the hose and they're busy just damping everything down. And when the weather's hot and dry, really it's about the worst thing you can do. Although I suppose there's uh, always exceptions in gardening and with runner beans in the evening if it's very hot with old varieties just damping them down and cooling the air helps them to set. But if I just turn that off for a minute it's much better for most of the watering if you have a piece of cane tied onto the end of the hose and not too strong a pressure and then feed the water right down where it's wanted so it sinks really deep in around the roots that's where you need it and don't be afraid if the weather is very dry to give them a bit of water and then to water again here you can see the benefits of sowing in succession my first sowing of runner beans done fairly early in May and then a month later a second sowing so that I don't get all of the crop coming at once. And you can see from the lush growth we can have a pretty good yield. But my uh, cane on the end of the hose really does make watering much easier and putting it at fairly low pressure exactly where the water's needed. And when it comes to plants in pots, you can actually lift the foliage and see what you're doing as you place the water exactly where it needs to be. Watering made easy.